Hey everybody, this is Josh from Collection DX. What I've decided to do with these is I'm going to do these now in uh, 10 set reviews, right? So every 10 sets I build, I'm going to show you what you make 10 sets at a time. Because there's going to be like 100 sets here, so it's it's going to be too much to do like a review every video. But I've completed the 10 sets, and we will now show you what, what you've built after 10 sets. So today is uh, Thanksgiving 2022, and uh, my wife and I decided to stay home this year. It's just uh, I'm not feeling good physically, and um, it's just a lot, right? So um, we're going to have some friends over later. It's a kind of a small thing, but I have some time here, and I wanted to... Uh, oh, Jesus, I was looking for this piece. Uh, anyway, I wanted to kind of talk to you about this kit, and but first of all, I wanted to say thank you um, for watching, whether you're a subscriber who has been here for years or somebody just sort of stumbled across this. Uh, it means a lot to me that people still do watch to some extent, although the numbers aren't what they used to be, but largely that's, I think, the shift in the YouTube culture and algorithm, and sort of maybe reflective on my refusal to sort of bend to these trends where we're doing dumb stunts and top 10 this bullshit or making thumbnails with my big gaping mouth going, oh, look how amazed I am. That's just stupid. You're not here for me. You're here for the toys. So you'll see, you'll hear me. You'll see my hands, but I'm not looking to develop any kind of like stupid cult of personality. I'm not going to do any dumb stunts. This is just... This is what I do, right? So I just want to say thank you if you're still here and watching. I may not do as much as I used to, but it still means a lot to me when I see comments and, and views and things. And uh, I do have a goal someday to get that little silver 100,000 subscriber mark, but, uh, you know, get that little metal to hang in my wall. I don't think it's ever going to happen because the amount of, like, bullshit, pandering crap that you have to do would be astronomical, you know? And I know, like, whenever I do something that's Voltron or Power Rangers or whatever, people, I get the high views and, and whatever. I just, I'm, I don't care, right? I just want to do what I want to do, and that's what this is. So that being said, this is what I want to do. I want to just check out cool shit and make videos uh, when I have time and, and talk about it. So here we go. This is... The um, Knight Rider from Fan Home subscription set. Now, I know people complained a lot about the cost in the comments. That it is, by the time this subscription is done, it's almost $1,000. Which is a lot, right? And I'm honestly a little surprised that they agreed to give it to me, right? But I'm not going to complain because uh, this has been a really fun experience. So, this is what you get when you do the first 10 sets. So, this is just 10 Thing. So you get the hood, which is die cast metal. This thing is heavy and you got little uh, hinges and things. But there's a lot of like build this part and put it aside. So it's not like every part segues into the next part. So like you do the hood, you put it aside. Next part is uh, uh, the nose to some extent. Oh, I'm actually, uh, you know, it's got, some, it's got the, the lighting in here. And I'll show you a little video. It gives you like a, a control box to test what the lights look like. Super cool, but this is, you know, partly a partly finished nose. And again, die cast metal. <laughs> I can't understate how heavy this is. So that's another part. There is the uh, the dashboard that I'm slowly building. You're going to see that um, each one of these kind of sections is a little hole for the light. So all of these will light up. And obviously it's, it's uh, incomplete right at this time. But again, this is, uh, you know, I think this was uh, number five or something. I don't know exactly. But, you know, well, this is not metal. This is all plastic. And around this time, you start amassing sort of like parts for later, right? So here's part of the, the steering wheel. Here is part of the, uh, this is like the battery box with a control switch for the lights. Here's another part of the steering wheel. So you'll amass, you know, a bunch of this stuff that like will come into play later, but they're giving you little pieces of, you know, what to do. And I like the way that they rolled these out because they give you sort of like hints to where you're going to be later on in the kit. So this is the beast right here. Holy crap. 
I feel like I am building an actual car. Like, not like a model of a car, but a car. So this is like the front assembly uh, of the um, suspension and steering. All right, so here's the big, here's the big draw. This thing is like 98% metal, right? This is the front end of the car. There's frame pieces, there's cross members, there's sway bar shit. Um, look at this. You can actually like, you know, turn the steering. This, this is gonna eventually attach to the steering wheel, but like you can turn the wheels with that, right? There is there's working suspension with real springs. There are brake lines. Uh, the amount of detail here is astounding. And like I said, mostly metal. The tire is rubber. The uh, brake assembly is uh, plastic. This, uh, I think this is a sway bar thing. This is plastic. And the rubber hosing is plastic. But that's it. It's metal and it's heavy, right? So imagine this is only 10 sets so far. This thing is going to be a monster, right? This is going to be an insanely large assembly here, right? Like, holy crap, this thing is going to be insane. So when you say like, Oh, a thousand dollars. That's too much. Well, first of all, it's spread out over like, I don't know, a hundred things. So, you know, a hundred, like 25 shipments, right? So that's a lot because you get more than one sort of issue in a shipment. But the, the quality and the density and the heaviness and the intricacy is uh, astounding. I am building an actual freaking car like I was not prepared so I don't know man it just gives you a little insight of how like what you're getting for that that uh that value you know um and again I'll put a little code in there I don't even know if to be honest I don't even know if the code's still valid if it was just for like the engagement that we did or, or what but I'll put it in anyways um but I will say I get it now right now that I've done it I get it. This is going to be a monster of a vehicle. It is going to weigh a ton. I mean, this alone, like, got to weigh two pounds, right? And I'm not kidding. Like, this is all die cast metal. All these bars, these gearboxes, all the screws to put it together, the the different, I mean, the different pieces that have to move. Like, it's all metal, dude. It is crazy. So yeah, uh, and you know, it's, it does roll. It's a little, the plastic is a little hard for the tires, but it's, it's again, it's fine. Um, yeah, that's just like, I want to give you an update of where we're at with, ep uh, on sort of issue 10 and I've probably got up to issue 20 done. So, you know, there'll be more once I dig more into it. I was a little kind of distracted with life and all that, but here you go. This is what it is. Uh, this is Josh from CollectionDX.com. Again, I want to say happy Thanksgiving if you're enjoying it with your family or not. And, uh, of course, you're probably not watching this on Thanksgiving. So I hope you had a good one if you did. And that's it. So, you know, like, subscribe, tell your friends, accost your mailman, whatever you want to do. It doesn't really matter. Um, I'm still going to be here at some point. Bye.